Okay, folks, so I have some moon footage from last night here. It shows some other interesting lights in the sky, too, that were up there with the moon that I zoomed in on. And, and there's another plane uh, that comes through further in the video, and you can actually see it, like, spraying out in, you know, as it passes through the light of the moon. So um, I've already uploaded it here to Rumble. There's a link in the description and a link in the comment section and a link on my community page if you want to see it. You can see it right away right here on Rumble. As far as YouTube is concerned, YouTube is going to get a blurred out and blacked out version for now because they're just going too far with some of this stuff. And, and this is my view when I'm uploading a video. It doesn't matter what video it is, okay? Every video that I upload, I have to go through. I can, you know, choose a thumbnail, choose a playlist, and I have to go through and click show more for other options. And what we have down here are boxes that are automatically checked, okay? And I usually will uncheck this automatic chapters to allow automatic chapters in key moments because I don't want YouTube to decide what key moments there are in my video. If I believe there are key moments in my video, then I will put a link with a timestamp in the description or the comments, okay? So I usually uncheck that one. Automatic places, not so bad. I'll leave that one. Not, not a big deal. Everybody knows where I'm at anyway and what my location is. So, But this one here, this experiment with allowing automatic concepts, which is automatically checked. You can see it there. I have to uncheck it or YouTube will add additional content to my description. Automatic concepts, which helps viewers to learn more about unfamiliar terms without leaving the video. Concepts mentioned in your video may automatically appear in the description. So now the context tags aren't enough, YouTube. You want to add additional information and add concepts to my description of my content too? And folks, this is almost, it, it's almost the straw that has broken the camel's back. You know what I mean? It's stressing the camel's back out to a point now where I'm, this, this video here that you're seeing, in the video that, that you're going to see on YouTube of the moon, is going to be heavily blurred and redacted. If you want to see the full video, you're going to have to go to Rumble for now. And I mean for now. And I'll decide, maybe, maybe. If there's enough of any kind of a response or an outcry or a bunch of people complaining, maybe I'll upload an unblurred version and the full version of the moon here on YouTube. But as far as I'm concerned, YouTube is going to way too far. The context tags weren't enough, right? This here, though, I don't need YouTube to add context and add concepts and help people to be familiar with unfamiliar terms in my videos and in my content. No, thank you. I don't need an editor and I don't need a producer. Seriously. It's just too much, folks. I really, really hope that you all understand. This is why I'm telling you, go to, to Rumble, okay? Because YouTube is going too far. And as far as I'm concerned, they don't deserve my content, okay? That might seem a little bit conceited to some, but I have seen some pretty shitty-ass content creators out there that have, like, thousands and thousands of subscribers and they have shitty ass videos, but they're ganking ad rev. You know what I mean? They're getting paid. They're getting paid off of the backs of other content creators that create content that they insert ads in, but they're not getting paid. Content creators like mine. And there are literally thousands of other content creators like me that are not being allowed to participate in that part of it and earn anything off of it other than frustration. This is just too much. Allowing concepts, allowing automatic concepts, and then you have the box automatically checked. Like, I don't have a choice unless I go through and manually uncheck these boxes. You're going to add additional concepts automatically in the description. No, thank you. Watch the full video on Rumble or don't. The choice is yours. Yeah, I'm not sure what that other light is out there with it, but they're both pretty bright. I'm seeing one, two, three, four pretty prominent and bright other lights out there around the moon. So I'm not sure what this one is. It's traveling with it, but it's awfully sparkly. Review. Uh, 
Terminator line today. Oh yeah, that's as close as I can get. There it is. At least with the Panasonic. This is what the Panasonic Lumix DCMZ80. Well, it looks like there's a few sparkly things going on. Yeah, no, that one's coming in too high, too.
plane coming. Oh, man. This little tip of it disappeared. 